Number one, I think the word sharded should be accepted by all, taught in schools, and be put in the dictionary. Number two, when I see a guy that's in his 30s on a BMX bike with the shirt off, I just make the assumption that they don't have a job. Number three, do you think Thomas Crapper, the guy who invented the toilet, would have invented the toilet if he knew that we would have been saying, I'm going to take a crap? Number four, I think it's time for Hollywood to do a modern version of the movie The Breakfast Club. Number five, with all the advances of medical technology, why are we still using our finger to check one's prostate? Number six, I don't own a tie and I find them weird. Number seven, I find Bible stories somewhat ridiculous and they insult my intelligence. But I was thinking about the story around the city of Enoch that the Lord felt that the city was so righteous that he took it up into heaven. And I think about the people who were living in the rural communities that came into town. The Number eight, I actually think a good fart is pretty funny. But if you do it at the dinner table, you're going to piss me off. Number nine, I have to admit, there's one childhood game that I actually enjoy playing. That's Old Maid. They should make that a drinking game for adults. Number 10, in Utah from 2011 to 2014, the rate of gonorrhea has gone up in men 296% and in women 714%. How's that education around abstinence working for you, state of Utah? Number 11, I prefer to board a plane about in the middle of the pack because that gives me the opportunity to be able to choose who I get to sit next to as opposed to someone choosing to sit next to me. Number 12, I've always found this interesting that someone's looks and their personality because I've seen good looking people and then when I get to know them, not so good looking. And then I've seen okay looking people after I get to know them, they actually look pretty good. Number 13, I want to end with an anonymous quote. Things are not happening to you. Things are happening because of you. Peace.